The overall goal of the following experiment is in vitro monitoring of cardiac beating clusters derived from human embryonic stem cells in 3D, real-time, and high spatial resolution. This is achieved by first culturing and expanding embryonic stem cells until they form embryoid bodies. Next, the beating clusters are dissected and plated on polytetrafluoroethylene or PTFE porous filters, which allows them to be maintained as long-term air liquid cultures. Then, beating clusters are labeled with harmonic nanoparticles in order to perform real-time multi-photon microscopy. Results obtained allow the analysis of spatial elongation and frequency of cardiac contractions at the microscopic scale. So the main advantage of these nanoparticles is that you can use any wavelength, especially infrared, so you can go deeper in tissue. And they are also very stable over time, so you can monitor long processes over long time frames. This stem cell culture method can help to answer key questions in the field of cardiomyocyte functional contraction in three dimensions, in particular cardiac maturation and tissue engineering. Individuals new to this method should be aware that the labeling procedure with harmonic nanoparticles can only be used for multi-photon microscopy and cannot be transferred to other kind of imaging systems. We first had the idea of using harmonic nanoparticles in 2005. These nanoparticles present advantages with respect to fluorescent dyes. And